All right, guys, so today we're going to be practicing the op art tubes on this piece of paper. You're going to be turning this paper in for your grade, so please make sure that you write your name on the bottom right hand corner and your period number. So, the first thing I would like for you to do on your piece of paper is draw a rectangle. I would like for you to do this in pencil. Then you're drawing three wavy lines that are going down or vertically on your rectangle. They can be any sort of wavy style, like so. And then you're drawing one line across your paper and it is also going to be a wavy line. The key with this technique to make your op art tubes look 3D is by drawing curved lines that are going up in this direction if they're above this line or down in this direction if they're below this line. And the type of curvy line that I'm looking for is a C-shape or a crescent. And the best way to do it is by having these crescent lines start and end on the previous line that you drew. So like that. So let's go ahead and try that technique in one of these tubes. Also, you need to keep these curves inside of this fenced area. So remember the curves have to go up this way if they're above the line. Like so, and they should start and end on the previous line. And then if they're below this line, they should go curved down, like so. It shouldn't take you very long to complete one column. But I would like for you to complete at least all four of your columns that you have. If it's easier for you to hold your paper like this, then go ahead and try that or you can turn your paper completely around, whatever works best for you. I do not want you to do this. Do not do that. That is not approved. Just don't do it. I would like for you to create lines that are curved like a C-shape or a crescent. That will help in creating the whole 3D effect for the op art tubes. That's the whole entire purpose of this lesson. If you have yet to do so, please make sure that you go onto Canvas and complete your follow along and the lesson presentation that is also on Canvas.